Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I tried out this Linux distro that looks exactly like Windows, except it's made by a Microsoft engineer and it's based on Ubuntu. And honestly, I'm kinda in love with it. So let's dive in. All right, so moving from Windows to Linux can feel like terrifying at first, you know? You worry about missing your apps, the layout's different, and it just feels uh, foreign. Ubuntu and Linux Mint already make that jump easier, but Anduin OS takes it a step further by looking and feeling like Windows 11 right out of the box. You've got the same color scheme. The taskbar, it's all there. Start menu, weather widget, system tray icons. It's uncanny. But at the same time, it's smooth and snappy like Linux tends to be. Underneath all that shine, it's still Ubuntu, so you get the rock-solid stability and user-friendliness that Ubuntu is known for. And it comes in two flavors, an LTS release for long-term support and a short-term release for the latest features. I tested the latter and yeah, it was smooth. One cool tweak, instead of forcing snap packages like Ubuntu does, Anduin OS defaults to Flatpak. So installing apps is like way more consistent. But hey, if you want to swap in apt or snap or whatever, you totally can. Now, here's where it really shines. Those GNOME extensions, Anduin OS bundles a suite that merges the dock and status bar into one Windows style taskbar using dash to panel. You can right click it, tweak height, width, colors, you name it. And the arc menu, that's the start menu clone. It's super responsive, has multiple layouts. My favorites, the Windows 10 style with apps on the left and pinned on the right. You can customize everything, with folders show up, panel width, menu height, it's nuts. And because it's Genome, you can go even deeper. I added clipboard history instead of the default clipboard indicator, an emoji copy panel just like Windows and tiling shelf for fancy zones style window management. These extensions really let you make Anduin OS your own while still giving you that familiar Windows feel. So if you're a Windows user curious about Linux, Anduin OS might be the perfect middle ground. It feels like home, but it's so customizable that you can truly make it your own. Personally, I think it's a fantastic introduction to Linux customizations without the steep learning curve. All right, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and ring that bell for more Linux content. Have you tried Anduin OS? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.